Hey guys, Master of Lore back at it again, and today we're diving back into Westeros and doing another small discussion of a smaller character uh, who only appears really in Dance of Dragons, but an uh, interesting character nonetheless for one specific reason, which I'll mention later on. So yeah, so today we're talking about Kago, who is a character that appears in A Dance of Dragons, and we see him really with the Quentin Martell uh, character storyline, and I'll read a quick quote from Quentin Martell now. Kago corpse killer the men were calling him now though not to his face he was quick to anger and that curved long black sword of his was as nasty as its owner thoughts of quentin martell dance of dragons so who is kago kago is a man with a seamed and scarred face quick to anger but he was well regarded by the tattered prince the leader of the windblown which is a uh, cell sword company in the as in Essos, uh, Kago rides a monstrous warhorse and wields a rare rack of Valyrian steel. Which is why I wanted to talk about this character, because he has a really rare weapon. So the Arak is the weapon wielded mostly by the Dothraki, and the fact that it's a Valyrian steel. Arak is really, really rare and really interesting, and the reason why I wanted to talk about this character. As we know, other Valyrian steel swords in the story are Ice, of course, which gets turned into uh, Widow's Whale and Oathbreaker. Um, and we also know that Jorah Mormont's uh, father sword, uh, which is now with Jon Snow, is also a Valyrian steel. We know the Valyrian steel dagger that Arya uses, the uh, cat's paw. And then we also know, of course, of Dark Sister. And there's so many other ones. But anyway, it's really cool that he has one that's an, a rat. So the only backstory for Kago that we really know is that Sir Lucifer Long resents him uh, because once uh, Sir Lucifer Long had a slave girl that was then taken by Kago. Kago, and the Dothraki then killed the girl because he thought she was ugly. And in the story, we only really see Kago in A Dance of Dragons when he participates in the Siege of Astapor, uh, when he uh, hacks down Cleon, the butcher, king of the city, and Kago becomes known as a corpse killer. But it's revealed that Cleon was just a corpse and armor tied to a horse, which is really interesting. So Kago is also present when the Tattered Prince meets with Quentin Martell and his companions um, in the undercellar of the Purple Lotus, a marine, when they all agree to Quentin's proposal to steal one of the dragons of Daenerys and then of course we know what happens to Quentin he essentially gets burned by one of the dragons and then he is uh essentially ditched by all the cell swords that join him so his companions leave him we don't really know what happens to Kago after but of course the dance of dragons is the last book that we know of uh currently in the storyline so yeah guys i really just wanted to talk about Kago because he has a, a rack made of valyrian steel which i thought was really interesting I hope you guys thought he was interesting as well, and let me know in the comments below who you guys think is interesting that's a smaller character in Westeros or Middle-earth or whatever you guys are into, and uh, leave a like and subscribe. Thanks guys, and have a good one.